Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. My name is Muhammad Shweb. Welcome back. Today we are diving into Siemens WinCC Unified to explore how to control the text visibility in resource list. This is a powerful feature that allows you to manage a multiple text element dynamically and efficiently. So let's get started. A resource uh, list in the WinCC Unified is a collection of resources like X element that can be managed dynamically. By using the resource list, you can control the visibility of multiple text element based on the conditions that make your HMI screen more organized and responsive. So here you can see uh, we are showing like the local remote status and this status uh, this example we are using the resource list so once our tag local tag value is true here the text will show the local once my remote tag value is true local tag value is false and remote tag value is true so in that case it will show me the remote status. So let's see how we can configure the resource list in the WinCC Unified. So we'll open uh, the project that we already created in our previous tutorials. So we'll use the same. So we'll take the text object and paste it here. And I will write the name. I will change text size and appearance change white. Similar manner, I will take one more text object. The name. I will color also. Okay. So now uh, we'll come here in the local and then in the general text. So here we will select this time the resource list. Once you select the resource list, so you have to add whatever you value you want to show in the text list so the text list you can find it from the left side here text and the graphic list double click it here okay and we'll go down so here i will add a new text list that name local Status yes, and I will add here the value. So I will select it one, press enter, and I will write it here local. So once the value is true in this, uh, in our uh, local tab, and in that time it should show the local. Similar manner, I will add one more list. I will remote status and then here I will write a one value. I will write the remote. That's it. I will save it and I will close it. Now we'll come back. So first we we'll select the our tag that name is the local common local. And after that we have to select the text list and then 
we browse our so just now we created a text list for the local status select it and similar manner for the remote come in general text select the resource list and then we select our tag like that is these one remote and from here select the text list and then select our remote status just align properly both of the them save it and download record the look so our project successfully downloaded on the runtime runtime is now so here you can see my remote tag value is true that's why i'm getting the remote signal i will put it zero and then i will turn on the local and right now you can see now my local tag value is true and i'm getting the local text so alhamdulillah we we'll learn in this tutorial video how we can configure the text visibility using the resource list so in the resource list the text list we put it like for the local uh, we put it uh, we configure it so we can configure multiple texts in the resource list so that we configure it and here after that we are able to here see our local and remote status so thanks for watching this video